Michelle Bridget Bartlett here. I am the local business marketing and training and support specialist with BuilderAll. Welcome to step 15 of our sales funnel challenge. We've already created the blueprint, pages, email list, booking calendars, checkout items, membership areas, and then we even designed all of our pages. So today we're going to do an overview of our funnel so you can walk through the customer journey and experience the buying process for yourself. So you can truly understand the power of automating your sales process and lead generation. So, so far we have created a lead magnet to get them to opt in by giving them an ebook. We've created an email confirmation page so that they can confirm their email so we can create a double opt-in for a higher quality of list. We've created a front end offer, which is a sales funnel course that they need to purchase. Once they've purchased that, they get access to the upsell offer, which is private coaching. If they decide to purchase that, they will check out, get access to our scheduler page. And then once they've scheduled, they'll go to the thank you page to get access to all of our items in the sales funnel. If they decline the upsell offer, they'll go to the downsell offer, which is a group coaching session. If they decide to purchase that, they will go through the checkout process. They will go to the thank you page of that offer where they schedule their group coaching session. And then they will also go to the thank you page with all of our offers. We've also created four restricted areas or membership areas. So once they opt in, they can go to the lead magnet page, which is an automatic release. As soon as they opt in, no purchase necessary, but they do have to make a purchase to receive access to the front end offer, which is our course, the upsell offer, which is the scheduling for the private coaching, and then the downsell offer, which is the group coaching and scheduling. Okay. So let's go ahead and access our funnel and we can do that by entering the cheetah builder in the builder all back office. So let's go ahead and click enter. And before we start testing our funnel, let's make sure that it's actually published. So you can click the three dots here and click publish to make sure that our site is ready to go. So we'll click close. And then to get the link, we can click go to website. Now to test our funnel and make sure that it does not pick up any of our previous registrations and make sure that it is a working funnel for someone that is not logged in as we are, we want to go to guest and create a guest window. So we'll go ahead and paste the link. So now this is the very first page that our prospect or lead will come to. If we decide to opt in, go ahead and click download now. And here is where we are going to register inside our membership area to get access to our lead magnet. So I'll go ahead and fill this form out now. And we'll click confirm. And now we come to our email confirmation page where we have actually giving them a bonus offer to confirm. We've added a boost your online sales ebook as well as a checklist. And we have this flashing next step, check your email to confirm. So let's go ahead and do that now. So now you see we have two emails. So we have our welcome to our members area where we have the email address that we've registered into and our password and thank you for your application. We also have our email confirmation where we need to click to confirm that we are opting into the list. Okay, so let's go ahead and click now to confirm. And then we come to our first offer, which is the front end offer. Okay. So this is the sales funnel course that we are offering. In addition, you can download the lead magnets that we promised them. If they decide to purchase the item, they can click buy now and we'll go ahead and say, yes, we are going to purchase the course. So we'll click continue and let's go ahead and enter the information in here. And we'll go ahead and click pay now. And once we've purchased our front end product, we'll go ahead and click continue. And now that we've purchased that, we have the opportunity to purchase our upsell, which is our private coaching. Okay. So to purchase the private coaching, you need to apply. Once you fill out the application, you'll go through the checkout process and then you'll have the opportunity to schedule. But what if we decide not to purchase this? We can click here to say, no, thank you. Just take me to my course for now. And here we come to the group coaching session, which is our downsell offer.
So if we want to purchase the downsell, we can click here. If we decide we do not want to purchase that, we can click here to go to the thank you page, but let's go ahead and let's purchase the group coaching session. So we'll click buy now and we will go ahead and make the purchase. So we'll click continue and let's go ahead and enter our information. And we'll go ahead and click pay now and we'll click continue. And here is where we want to schedule our group coaching session. So let's go ahead and we'll just say that we want this one to be scheduled. Let's go ahead and enter our name. And also notice that we have the opportunity to access any of our other items here. So we'll go ahead and schedule our class. And now we come to the thank you page. So here again, we are promoting our upsell product because that is our private coaching, which is the most expensive. And we can also offer any of these products here. So let's go ahead and click this since this is an item we've purchased and you see that we do have access to schedule there. Let's click here because we did not purchase the upsell product. If you click there and you have not, you will not get access to that, okay? If we wanted to access our lead magnet, we could click here. And you see, we have the opportunity to download there and we also have our other products as well. If we want to access our course, we can click here and you see now we have our course and we also have the opportunity to access our other items in the sales funnel. So now that our funnel is complete, the next step in the customer journey is going to be the follow-up process. This is done with emails. Since we've already created our list in the next video, we're going to create an email sequence to follow up with our prospects. It takes seven to 10 times for a customer to be exposed to your business or brand to take action. So this is an incredibly important part of your sales funnel. So until then, go build it with Builderall.